Live is great fun. This is the Kosher Wine Review, and you know what? There's a good glass. <laughs> this is from Tom Winery in Itamar, in, uh, was it, Givot, Givot uh, Arnon. Arnon. <laughs> and uh, we're going to move on to the Shiraz for our second wine of this particular series. It is 14% alcohol. There's the 2014 vintage. And um, Ari Pollock and Tomer Panini are the proprietors of this particular winery. I definitely have not ever touched this bottle, I don't think. Did I taste the, the, the Shiraz last time? Shiraz, but it was oh, right. destroyed it was, by it the... It was blown out, right. The Franc is what I never tasted. Yeah, Franc. Right, and that one tastes, it looks smelling the best, but we'll see how the Shiraz turns out. Mm -hmm. Wow, pours really well through this. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Young wines that have seen over six months of oak, please, half an hour to an hour. If they've seen over a year of oak, an hour to two, if they've seen 18 to two, two years in oak, and it's a 2014 wine, two to four hours of airtime, decanting, maybe a little less, feel it out. But please don't think you can go into a wine store. I can go to a wine store, buy a bottle of wine that's like top, top notch, oh my goodness, awesome. You can go cork, pour, drink, and have a great effect on your taste buds. Sorry, but great things come with patience. Maybe let it age for a year or two on the shelf, or three or five on the better ones. Let's give it a smell. This is the Shiraz from Tom Winery. Hmm. Okay. Fruity, a little bit green, actually. So kind of a, a flavor I get on Shiraz sometimes, like some eggplant skin. The good eggplant skin, the lavender with white is the way to go. And mm -hmm. let's give it a taste. L'chaim the bracha. Already said a bracha, I'm not cheating. That's all I got. Cool. Okay. Subdued for Shiraz. And what do I mean by that? It doesn't have any explosive fruit and or jamminess. It's pretty clean on the palate though. No residual alcohol. Drinks well. A little bit on the, on the finish here. It's 14% alcohol. I'm not getting any, no heat. Um, fruit's good residual. Dry wine. No heavy tannin. Uh, the acid does come through a little extra snappy. Again, I'd like to see the wines sit down for an extra like three to six months to see kind of where they integrate. What I mean by that is the, you have acid, you have tannins, you have fruit. The better wines, they all come together. Sometimes when they're younger, they may be a little out of balance. Or after traveling, sometimes they can be out of balance. The fruit's good on the palate. Very minimal wood, actually. Even with that tan, it doesn't go woody or cedary. A little overly green. Again, the wine's young, but it tastes good. Like the fruit's good that he's getting, you can tell. Nice coating. This one will work better with like a, a steak or, or a lamb or even like some eggplant dips. And um, we're going to wish you a beautiful day. This is the 2014 Shiraz from Tom Winery from